Hi guys welcome back i'm maya from simply bloom so it is the next day from when you just saw me planting the hydrangea trees and i love it so i planted you can kind of see we have we call this section the teardrop it kind of the driveways goes in and it forms like a teardrop and i planted three hydrangea trees or standards on each side i love it let me show you okay i'm trying to get so you can see but there's one two three and then you can see right in front of them i planted a row of daffodils and muscari oh so pretty and those are really good at naturalizing so eventually i'm gonna have like a thick row of daffodils a thick row of um muscari and then once they're you know done blooming for the season then we'll just come through and mow them back and then i planted up the whiskey barrels last night they always look so sad <laughs> so sad before they really fill in but those should look gorgeous and then right here you can see my <sighs> alliums that i transplanted obviously suffered they did not enjoy the move um, but I have a few that are just about to open and then I will be potting or not potting planting this with sedums and other ground covers for like a little rock garden and then I plan on putting two David Austin roses on either side but that is it for today's video thank you so much for watching I hope you have a great day oh I didn't even tell you which hydrangea trees I planted hold on so the first two are phantoms, the middle two are limelights, and then the last two are some more phantoms. I feel like they're both fairly similar. They both kind of have that longer um, shape of blooms. The phantoms start white and then they fade to a, a light pink, and then the limelights start green, lime green, and then they fade to like a mauvey, dusty, rosy pink. I'm very excited for those. That is it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you next time. Bye.